welcome back to my channel. So today I got a packaging from Revolve. I'm going to Miami this weekend. And I bought a few little items that are ready for me to wear out to dinner or to the beach. I'm not gonna lie to you, taking some of these things out of the packaging, I'm like, wow, definitely not something I wore to a restaurant. <laughs> so I'm gonna probably try to have to wear bathing suits under half of the dresses. I didn't know they were that see-through, but this is the first little outfit I got. I'm not gonna lie to you. I feel like this is the kind of thing that I could buy off of a cheaper boutique and you would really not know a difference because with this kind of outfit, I'm only gonna wear it once. I'm not gonna wear this twice. <laughs> So with that said, it was, I'm not sure how much it was, but I know it wasn't really cheap. And I bought a small top. It actually comes down lower, but it's too big. So I've tied it in the back. That will have to be tailored as well. And the pants are large. They fit my bum and my thighs perfect. But when it comes here, you see like it's very big. So it's not that flattering. If it was tight, this would be a vibe, you know? It would be fire, but, oh, and I love the bell bottom pants. Let me see if I could show you guys. The pants, I also bought some heels too because I've kind of gotten into buying more mid-range leather goods or just goods in general, just cause I feel like, again, you're wearing these things not so often and the mid-range prices are still just as great and they have more design options, I feel like, and they're just so cute, so bought some of those I'll try the heels on for you too but I do like this one it's gonna take some tailoring you see but yeah I hate that for something that I'm only gonna wear once it just doesn't feel worth it oh this is cute So this swimsuit, even though I have like literally two million swimsuits, I'm playing it back home, my boyfriend doesn't watch this. So even though I have two million swimsuits, I always have to get a new one. It's just like necessary, okay? But this is from Luli Fama and it's from Revolve. I absolutely love the print, the stretch, the fit. Not gonna show you the back, but it is kind of like a Brazil, like a full Brazilian cut, really lifts and has the ruching still shows cheek but still is like not g-stringy it's very 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 as appropriate as sexy can be but it is super flattering and i love it i think it's something about like the stitching or something i don't know i'm gonna do the iphone videos Yeah, it's the stitching, it's the print, it's the color, it's everything, like with the tan, and just, it's just beautiful. And I, I like little details like this, this little pendant in the, on the ties is just so sexy how it falls on your thigh. It's just little details. Like I said, there's so many swimsuit companies. There's so many different brands. You really have to look into the small details of things to kind of, you know, set yourself apart. Definitely love this one though. All right, I'm super excited about this one because I have been dying to have a Kim Shui dress in my closet. But I will say, I didn't think that they were like literally see-through. <sighs> it is a weird see-through kind of thing where it's like very illusion based and you kind of feel like you don't see anything, but I definitely wore covers. That wasn't gonna risk it. <laughs> it's not worth it for me, but the back you know it's it's just really risky i would love to wear this with some heels to dinner but to be honest with you i feel like it's more of a cover-up however don't know if the price tag is cover-up worthy you know what i mean but more power to you i feel like girls if you feel like you're comfortable enough to go out in something that's this see-through do your thing there's nothing wrong with that i just think it's a little see-through but it's super cute I think with like the iPhone, you'll be able to see more of what I mean.
Okay guys, so this is another bodysuit that I actually got on sale, which I love. And I think it is super cute. It fits amazing. I bought a small and it actually fits like my torso. Because <laughs> usually my torso is way too long for a small, but it actually fits perfectly. So I'm very happy with that. Feel very supported on the chest area, snatches at the waist and really just flatters your body. And it has like these little keyholes that's very, very sexy, flattering, like I said. And if you're like me and you get cold at dinner, there's this little thing that it has. Oh my God. And they have thumb holes. How cute. I love this so much. So probably with some jeans. I actually bought heels. So I'm gonna do the, I'll show the heels after the iPhone. But I actually bought heels that I think match with this perfectly. So I wanted to do a shoe aspect of this. Sorry, my jean marks on my calves. But I bought these on sale. Actually, I'll link them in the bio. They're from Revolve and I thought they would go really, really cute with the bodysuit with different colors and this just goes to show that everybody's different i read the reviews obviously because when a shoe goes on sale i always look at reviews because i'm curious as to why they did not work but yeah so these actually had a few reviews saying that the middle piece right here was uncomfortable but honestly i love them and it's not uncomfortable for me so yeah I wish I would have done it six and a half. They're super cute. They're actually like a metallic blue. I thought they were gonna be like super royal blue, but they're actually kind of metallic iridescent, if you could see. So I was too lazy to put it on my other foot. <laughs> I don't like when I see some heel here. I'm a six and a half, but I usually get a seven in heels, just, you know, to give myself a little extra space because I have fat feet. But these are super cute, and I really love the powder blue toes with the powder blue sandal. Yeah, that little piece in the back is bothering me, but I guess like I could just bring my foot. But then you see this. Oh, I probably could have done the six and a half, but still cute. Still very cute. I'm very happy. I can still make them work. Again, off from Revolve, I just wanted a one-stop shop. That's why these places like Revolve get away with the shit that they do because it's a one-stop shop. I get a dress, heels, and a purse that match perfectly, and it's been working for me. So, adorable. I like long bodysuits because I feel like they really cut you in the place that you need to be cut. I got this in a medium and I actually have it pinned because I'm going to get it restructured. I'm going to take it to the tailor along with the other pants and it's going to make it match. But it's just so hard nowadays. I'm normally waist size, extra small, small. But now I have a woman's breast. So it makes sizing very difficult. And the one thing that I could recommend for mid-sized ladies is to find a good tailor. Someone who's cheap, someone who's reliable that you could just literally pop in and they're gonna make some time for you and you could just get quick so most of if they're not too crazy like just a waist alteration it'll be like anywhere from 20 to 60 bucks if it's a dress then you're getting a little more into the pricier range but again i feel like dresses especially denim pants super worth the tailoring because those are the things that you're gonna wear over and over again the bodysuit i like it So 
I have actually been super into baby doll dresses. I had to reference Lindsay Yandel, good old legends. Baby doll dresses are super flattering. They are a cross between cute and sexy and still appropriate. So this one's a little bit short, but I feel like it's still doable. It's just the details of these dresses like the little ruching here, the way your breasts are cupped, just how it's ruched in the waist and then it flares out. It just really is so flattering. I may or may not be able to wear heels with this one, but I love it anyway. All right, that was a quick one. I told you guys it was gonna be super fast, but I wanted to actually, I thought it was a cool idea to really clue you into a few pieces that I picked on my own. I think out of everything, I don't know if I would say this one. I really like the multicolored bodysuit. I think it fit really great. The one sleeve black bodysuit, but of course I'm so basic, I'm not like that. And the bikini, the bikini fit the best actually. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with the bikini. With that said, I will be coming back to you guys. I don't know how I'm gonna be filming, while I'm in Miami, but we'll figure it out. So until next time, please let me know what you like and what you didn't like. Let's make this another giveaway. So all you have to do is, again, tell me which one was your favorite outfit. And that's pretty much it. You just have to comment below and on my IG, let me know which one was your fave. And yeah, we'll see who, who gets picked for this win. No, but seriously, so. You guys know that I'm a sucker and I might end up picking two, but either way, please be safe, please be kind. And until next time, guys, I love you and that's it. Meaning though.